Ever since the untimely cancellation of Knight Rider 3 decades back, I have wondered what made TV networks cancel perfectly rated, popular TV shows that didn't have other options, read Netflix, to revive them. Each year they cancel shows without giving them the time to conclude their stories and 2018 isn't much different. Nearly every TV network in the United States has had its part in the cancellation of popular TV shows and while some deserved it, some like Lucifer and Brooklyn 99 certainly didn't. Let's talk about some of these shows and discuss whether cancelling them was a good idea or a really bad one. Quantico, three seasons, ABC, what happened, I couldn't think of a bigger, and better, reason to cancel the show than listening to Priyanka Chopra's super fake accent, if that wasn't the reason, then it would have been the presence of PC as first an FBI agent, later a CIA agent and finally as a fugitive. The surprise move, the network renewed the show after the first season in order to bank on Priyanka's popularity but once the ratings dipped, they didn't want to go back. Verdict, excellent Lucifer, three seasons, Fox, what happened, how can you cancel a TV show that has millions of fans all over the world, has Tom Ellis playing the proverbial devil and features the eternal bad guy doing something good, for a change. Fans were devastated, especially after the season finale where Lucifer reveals his true self to Chloe and the episode ends on a cliffhanger. One hopes that some network or streaming website, Read Netflix, gets hold of this goldmine and makes Fox realize that they might have missed their step to greatness with a silly act. Verdict, terrible designated survivor, two seasons, ABC, what happened, season two of the series was a disappointment and maybe that's the reason why the network decided to pull the plug, it was a mirror image of the first season that had become extremely popular due to its plot, its storyline, and one-liners. I am sure Kiefer Sutherland would find some other role to make a return, after all, there are a lot of characters other than President's Defender and the President for the talented actor. Verdict, Good Superior Donuts, Two Seasons, CBS, What Happened, Not Many TV Shows Have Made You Smile The Way Superior Donuts Has, Not Only Was A War Going Between The New And Old Inside The Donut Shop, The Generation Gap Between The Two Characters Was Presented In An Excellent Manner. Each character had its own story to tell that made the series all the more popular. Cancelling it will hit the network later, trust me, verdict, Bad Scorpion, Four Seasons, CBS, What Happened, What Began as an Update to 1980s MacGyver and Mature Version of Big Bang Theory became a joke by the end of the third season. Yes, the character development kept the series going until enough was enough as it was going nowhere despite having talented individuals who could do no wrong. Since the team lost its way, the network thought it was best to pull the plug, for good. Verdict, Good Taken, Two Seasons, NBC, What Happened, Everyone Who Had Seen Liam Neeson's Taken Was Looking Forward To This Series Where Brian Mills Younger Version Was Shown As A Problem Solver, Long Before His Family Was Threatened. The first season was quite popular while the second faltered at some places, however, it didn't deserve a cancellation. The show had all the ingredients to become more popular but now it will go down in history as could have been a contender. Verdict, Bad The X-Files, 11 seasons, Fox, what happened? The X-Files should never have returned after the 9th season because the new seasons were nothing like the earlier ones. In fact, after the first two episodes of the new series, it went down the slope with no hope of making a comeback. The characters of Fox and Scully were developed further but not many were impressed, something that even struck the network executives who bade the series farewell earlier this month. Thank you, Verdict, Good Omer Lavi is a freelance broadcast journalist who can be contacted at via email protected.